Hey, what's up everybody? This is Wicked Android HD and as requested, I had to do a review on latest Euphoria ROM version 1.1 based on ASP 5.1.1 Lollipop. As you may see here, it says Euphoria version 1.1 GFLTE XX official based on 5.1.1 Lollipop. Colorful. Uh, firstly, I'd like to show you the score uh, my phone uh, obtained in uh, Antutu Benchmark 27,507 Decent score, not the best but not the least It is uh, right uh, below the HTC One but uh, as I do always say, it's not all about the numbers, it's about how the phone feels like in your hand, how it behaves, how smooth and fast it is. We'll get into the main features of this ROM. Uh, as you may see on the first look, it doesn't seem very different from other ASP ROMs. Uh, if you go into settings, you will normally see here in the device section uh, some ROM branded uh, category called uh, for example a slim features, ASP features, AKP features but these features are actually placed here in personal personal category you have here everything you want to customize on your device starting from the stock uh, application from Cyanogen mode 12 themes you can customize the look of your device by using themes that you download from Google Play Store system profiles you can set up uh, how your phone behaves while being on uh, while being in your car for example status bar, let's get into status bar, let me zoom in and show you all the features you got here okay my, my neighbors are just fighting outside uh, clock side, <laughs> the clock st style. Center, as you may see, clock is right in the center. Uh, you can show AM or uh, PM right next to the clock. Date, you can also set it right next to the clock just uh, in case you forgot if it's Friday. <laughs> yeah, it happens. <laughs> um, date style, date format can set it like this I just like the way it looks right here you can set up your weather as you may see it says weather information is not available because I haven't customized and I haven't got my location uh, turned on but I'll show you how to do it weather panel just say use custom location and I would s say Bucharest OK, click OK, verify location, Bucharest, and right now, as you may see, it says 75 Fahrenheit degrees, 75 Fahrenheit, but I'd rather go with metric, 24 degrees Celsius, kind of hot. Yeah. Um, network traffic, the default. Uh, network traffic icons there shows the traffic of course breathing notifications breathing SMS what the heck is this let's try it let's try it and see how it behaves let me send myself a message ok let me enter the phone number and let's say hey see how the notification looks like breathing notifications really interesting okay what's the difference oh it's um, it's fading out and in the icon as you may see <laughs> really cool touch 
small but cool touch where were we here in status bar so this breathing notification really looks awesome battery status style you have to choose from icon portrait landscape circle text and hidden battery percentages you may see 74 percent carrier label keyboard status bar carrier right here orange romania next to the icon yes next to the icon but carrier label disabled notification count and super user indicator we're not gonna use this because brightness control yeah notification draw you can customize your tiles uh, where quick settings tiles yes like this you can add as many tiles as you want here I like compass I do also like the play button the music DLT button I use LTE a lot, heads up notifications if you want to disable or enable them. Enable them. Um, what else? Screenshot, synchronizing the Gmail and so other, other stuff. Battery saver, let's see how it looks like. A lot of them. Battery saver, for example. Let me click the red button. Battery saver. Turn on the battery saver. Turn off the battery saver. Show four tiles per row. These are the usual usual uh, features that comes uh, that come with uh, every single ASP uh, run based on Lollipop. Multitasking. Uh, you can use Slim Recent Panel here. You see it. It was implemented by Slim ROMs. Has a little bit of lag, but I think it allows you to open the app in multi window. No. It used to allow me on a Resurrection Remix ROM, but apart from that, nothing special. Privacy. You can block color list. You can block color IDs, color numbers, location, and more. You can disable torch on screen off. Okay. So apart from that, everything is the same as on any ASP ROM nothing special phone app yeah you know what DPI is set to 360 you can customize the DPI by going into into display and lights and then scroll down until you see LCD density the battery I don't know if you saw the percentage at the beginning of this video, but right now it's 73%. Uh, just to make you a, an idea of how this, um, how much this ROM uh, eats. Yummy, yummy battery. So that was it, guys. Let me show you the lock screen. The full lock screen, ASP. That was it for today guys, I hope you liked it, if you did, as always, please thumbs up and subscribe right down to my channel. Thank you for more than 200, 2000 subscribers, it means a lot to me, and of course it always keeps me motivating doing this type of stuff. So, thank you guys for watching, Wicked Android is out. Bye bye.